Hello, John here, also known as Venonator, and welcome back to the TGC Tours. So we're at the Cracked Open in round number four now um, at the Lower Fishing Lake Golf Club. And yeah, it's been a good starting week in the TGC Tours in Season 11. We're in CCG, of course, and yeah, um, we made the cut reasonably comfortably. We got 17 under over the first two rounds. 14 under was the cut line, which is a crazy high bar, really. Um, but yeah, we managed to do it anyway. And then, yeah, we had another eight under round. So we've had two eight under rounds and one nine under round so far. And yeah, really pleased with it. It was in high winds and we, we played pretty well. Got some good putts as well, actually. So the putting was really good in the last round. So let's see how we can do in this final one. It's unlikely we're going to get promo marks this week, but it's not impossible. So we'll just play our best to see how we get on. And whatever happens, I'm pleased with this week. So the settings for this round. So we've got white tees, pin set four. So we've got medium winds from the northeast. We've got soft fairways, which is a new one. Green firmness is default. Green speed is fast. So the green firmness, I think, is just firm, but we'll see. Green firmness is firm. Yeah, there you go. So we've got soft fairways. So a little bit of a difference from before. It's been firm every single time up until this point. So yeah, having soft fairways, we'll see what difference I'm that makes. Glad to have you aboard. And I'm sending the good vibes. Hopefully you can feel that as I uh, as I put them out okay. into the atmosphere. I'm going to play a little bit safe. And, uh, but yeah, soft fairways may make this, this a little bit less dangerous. Today. There you go, decent. Yeah, we'll, we'll take that. Decent start, really. From the pin. Okay, so the pitch, in the pitch shot will not be affected by the wind really at all here. 98%, so a little bit short, but they do tend to skid these. Okay, okay no worries. shame. The green soon enough. Sadly did not bounce. Looking like. Okay, so this is fairway as well. It's not the fringe. Oh, okay, I mean, that was definitely well a... Judged on that, one. that was definitely a chippable okay. um, putt there, if that makes sense. I could have hold that with a chip, is basically what I'm trying to say there. Okay, a decent start. Here we go. Par five coming up. Let's see how we do here. Okay, so I hit that slow. The wind is pulling it to the right as well, but it's there's so much fairway. Well Love being on the challenger circuit. At least it's at least I have a lot of leeway <laughs> with things. So this is eight up essentially just over. So it's a hundred and four uh, sorry, two hundred and forty four. I'd say going with the hybrid here is probably about right. Hit it slow again, surprisingly. I don't usually hit the ball slow. That's two in a row. This one's it's a shame. Third. That felt very nice. That is a perfect tempo, that's why. Okay. Coming through with the chip. Here we go. This is for Birdie. And there you go. Well Birdie putt. Played to you. Yeah, so really positive start then. Well, I say pretty positive. One under through two. Yeah, pretty pleased with that. Happy with how we've started. We're playing par fives a bit better now. I tend to be getting birdies on them, which I haven't been doing um, before. I get a lot of pars on par five, which a lot of people say is wasting a shot. They're pretty much a guaranteed birdie a lot of the time for a lot of people. But it's something I need to sort of bear in mind. I'm going to add some loft to this. This may go over. We'll see. That's another slow. Hopefully this will bounce to the left. The distance was pretty good, actually. Grab your putter. Wonder what it would have done if it yeah, wasn't slow, actually. Footer. Definitely not playing for a slow at the moment. I'd, really as good. I say, it's not very often that I get them. Oh, right that's by. unfortunate. Here we go. That's a good effort. Par. That was a good effort for the um, the birdie attempt there. Um, it just turned just enough at the end. There's just a slight turn in it, and it was enough to stop it from going in. Okay, but it's a good effort. How things go here on the fourth. Okay, so this is eight essentially down. So we're looking at two, two, five, two, two, two there, two hundred and ten with the wind pulling it, and of course after account for bounces as well. It's the swing path was to the right, so we're doing a lot of hitting it to the right here at the moment. You'll be all right there. And this one from 31 feet. Okay, so this is quite a distance, this one. Okay, 
Okay. Decent execution by the looks of it. It's not I haven't um, adjusted enough, Tell but the pacing was great. All that way and not drop. So yeah, really pleased with the pacing, which made the next putt a lot easier, of course. Yeah, 26 under at the moment is great for the final round for me. I really... 30 under or better is really good. There's a stage where I could not hit 30 under, and I was aiming for that as a goal, and now I'm comfortably getting it quite regularly, which is nice. Not all the time, but yeah. Um, so this is pretty much 7 or 6, really. So it's 260. Um, and I don't have a club that does that. I could add four hybrid distance up here, hope. Added loft to it. Still not going to get there unfortunately, is it? No, I needed to adjust the free wood instead. Okay, That's fine. Green side sand. Let's see what you have. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Now Decent, a bit short. Bit sand, a little bit of work left to do, but nothing too serious. It's getting there. Yeah, just about good enough there. So there you go, birdie. And that's another par five where I've got a birdie on it, which is great. So two under through five. It's a bit of a slower start than every other event, I think, so far. No event, round. But two under at this stage is still positive. And yeah, the, the last um, round, I was the back nine. I just could not hit any birdies on. It felt like it. I'm going to go for a bit of a safer option. Wasn't the cleanest hit, but it was decent. It's decent enough. Nice shot. And this one's about 125 yards out. So I've added um, loft to that to lower it a little bit, and also added backspin to stop it from kicking out as much. And yeah, it went that's short, do just nicely. which Okay, it's not ideal for me adding the backspin, but it has worked out quite nicely. It's in a decent position. I did not hit that um, oh, as well as I was hoping to. It, I overpowered it. This putt's about four feet. Okay, nice. that's fine. I mean, it's a par again. I'm not really losing shots as such, as in I'm not getting bogeys and all that sort of thing. So that's really good. I haven't had too many bogeys on this course as of yet. This one's a part four. This is a tricky hole. Sadly, there just has not been the wind for this. They, they haven't had high winds pointing in that direction. I'm not going to risk it on the final round with a six mile an hour wind. It's just not powerful enough for me to to try it. I think it would have worked. I think Setting you could drive it. Boat. I'd say 100 yards out. But yeah, I'm not going to risk it. Okay, that's looking okay. Yeah, good. I'm happy and with that. Another approach. Nice. And this one is for It's a bit slanted, which these are quite tricky putts. Oh, that it did turn enough. Was I wasn't awesome. sure that was going to go in then, but yeah, there we go. We got a birdie out of that. That was a tougher putt, so I'm pleased with that. Yeah, sometimes they can be really tricky, those ones. Well, that was a case in point right there. Almost missed it. And hopefully you can stick this one close. Okay, I'm going to go pretty much as it is here. Just added a little bit of loft. Okay, executed exactly how I'd want it to do, but this is showing the calculation was a bit off. I've hit that too long. Okay, this one's 19 feet. Because that was exactly what I hoped to do in terms of the tempo and everything. I tend to play a little bit for fast. Because I hit ball fast. Oh, oh so close. It's a shame. And this next pot, I hit fast the more than I hit, you know, so so perfects in the middle. So there I tend to factor that in slightly. That's a shame that was a par, because that was a really good approach shot. But yeah, really decent effort at the putt as well, actually. It was close. But yeah, no, well, we got a par out of it. Par threes can be dangerous for that. If you miss hit one of the shots, then you're well, you're screwed, basically. Here on the ninth. Okay, 
Okay, just hitting this one right through the well, right into the middle. Pretty straightforward tee shot. About 130 yards to okay. go here. Right, so this needs to go over here because of the lie. And add, yeah, add some backspin to it. Oh wow, that really went. Left. That went way more that I way than I expected. I'm, I'm not mad. Come on, please stop. Okay, it's in a, Thanks hopefully in a salvageable position here. Yeah, it should be. This putt's going. Yeah. Okay. And nice straight putt. Work. There we go. So we've got a par, so that's great. And we're three under through the front nine, so it's an average, decent front nine in the end. So, yeah, got like eight under, and I got uh, nine under through my rounds. Two eight unders and a nine under. And I think I got three under on two of them, of those front nines. So I'm not too concerned about a three under front oh, yeah. nine. That's I'll, a pretty I'll, good start. Uh, I'll that. This shot is clocking in at 195 this looks about yards right. Okay, so on, I hit that fast. Right. Oh, it's a little You're bit too much. Every green today. Thought the wind That's would right. cut that down slightly. And there we go. We chipped it in. Chip shot. Nice Brilliant. Done in there. And my guy did not even celebrate. He just he's disappeared. That's it. He's fed up with this hole. He's gone on to the next one already. Twenty-nine under, great score. Now, all right, let's see what happens on hole four number under, nine. and we're through ten. Okay, so this is eight down. So two, yeah, one hundred and ninety-seven, and the wind is pulling it. So I'm going to go with the five iron, and just hit this as it is, more or less. Nice swing on that. One hundred one percent power. That's looking good. Oh, <laughs> at the hole. There. You found the green there, and that's uh, understating it. Yeah, I found the green and the hole there. That could have worked. That's your fifth. If that was um, a little bit less, well, accurate, probably it might have even gone in the hole if it had been hit before it. But uh, yeah, that was great. Did not even adjust the club at all. I just hit the standard five iron there. And there we go at thirty under. We still got holes to go. That's great. Really good. Now on the twelfth. Just shows you the standards in CCG. So it's in the safe area here in terms of I hit it in the grey marker of the tempo bar. And this Just is about, to be about did okay. Yards out. A little bit slow, which means it's gone really right because the wind. Okay, here's our third shot. Okay, that's fine. Oh, oh, oh yes, there we go. About, uh, Brilliant. He celebrated this out. one. That's two it's hole done. outs this round, which I haven't had that, I don't think, in the tournament. I don't, might have had one. But there you go. Three under through three on the back nine. Of course, not three under through three in general. Yeah, just in the back nine, but that's great. 31 under. Really, really happy. Let's I don't actually know what my score is on this round now. I'm going to have to figure that out next time. Next time I see the scorecard. I can't remember what I started I this, this with. To the fairway. Might be seven under. That I'm on. No, it's not. It's six under. Of course it is, because I'm on three under front right. Uh, front nine was done. We got a perfect tempo flop shot, which is great. All right, here's a five. A bit to the right, putt. but that's yeah, not complaining about that one at all. Looking good. Nice yeah. putt. That's nice birdie. simple putt, Number really. Seven on the day. Seven under. There you go. Thank you, commentator, helping me out there. Don't have to count. Seven under. Yeah, seven under at this stage is great, and what a great back nine this has been. After the last round, couldn't get a single birdie. I mean, I did get a few, but Let's see what it took me a while. I was hitting a lot of pars. I just had a bit of. Uh, a lapse in my this. Just, just my caught. tempo, which does happen. But that's a great tempo, perfect tempo, slightly right swing path, but the really not bad there. at all. That okay. So this is. Let's go with this. I don't know how much the winds 
going to affect this shot. Okay, that's decent. Yeah, I'm pleased with that. It's going to roll down this hill. It's going to be on the green. Just. I was a bit more confident than I should have been about that because it did seem to stop. This next putt is for the eagle. Okay, so this is a good opportunity, not for an eagle as such, but to get close for a birdie. It's a tough putt for an eagle. Oh, it's pacing good. Pacing is good. Oh, if it, it could have been slightly better and I would have got an eagle there. That was the right put line. Yeah, really good. Really good effort. Um, okay, and that's another birdie. So we're eight under. So this final round, we're doing really well. Is a par three hole. Eight under through 14. Okay. So the wind's pulling this. Well, it is slightly downhill. You make good contact. And 101%. This is looking like the right club. Yeah. Good stuff. All right. Nice approach on that one. About nine feet to the hole from here. This putt's good so far. Ah, oh, no. Weirdly, the and first beat didn't seem to do as much par. as the last beat did. Maybe I'm just imagining that. That's a shame. That was definitely a, another birdie opportunity. A good one. It's a shame. So 15 holes. Here we're, we yeah, go. seven under oh, through, hole number 16. through 15, I believe. Keep losing track of the score for some reason tonight. I always play this after I'm all, I've already been... I've used up all my energy, so that's why I'm always a bit dopey. Well, hopefully that's the reason I'm dopey. It could just be me. Nice. But I don't tend to play it when I'm actually at peak shot. performance, let's just say, <laughs> mentally. Another good flop shot. There I guess. One is for the bird. So yeah, definitely loving my flop shots these days. I tend to hit them really well. And I know, yeah, maybe sounds a bit arrogant. There's a lot of the game I'm not good go, at 17th hole. or need a lot of improvement on, but my flop shots is one of the bits I'm pretty happy with for the most part. If I had a top trumps card, that'd probably be my highest stat. All right, let's get out of For those stand. of you who know what Top Trump's card is, I don't know if that's been like a UK thing or what. Okay, yeah, I mean, right, it, to be honest, that was executed cup. very well. But the tricky out of a bunker there. Good putt. Oh, yeah, yeah, brilliant. Second consecutive birdie. Like what a great back nine this is. That is an incredible back nine. What a way to finish this. Yeah, really, really positive way to finish this. Um, wow, yeah, really happy. And yeah, so we got... Is it one hole to go? Yeah, the 18th hole. Here on the final hole of this one. Okay, this should do the trick, hopefully. Not a good shot. Oh yeah, well, uh, there we the go. Approach is heading a bit to the right. That's actually okay. Yeah, that's Even that, that was not a good shot. That's a good little approach shot. I mean, and John thinks it's a good shot, but of sixty on the day. Sixty. Okay, the putt and we're Phenomenal. Done. There you go. A sixty. Eleven under. Pleased with that. What a way to finish. Okay, so eleven under final round. Who knows, that might get me into the promo mark places, but either way, I'm really pleased with that round. What a great back nine. What did I get, eight under on the back nine? Possibly. That was, wow, 36 under. Yeah, really, really pleased. What a great week. First week back, 36 under. I am not complaining about that at all. That is an incredible start to the, to the season. Right, I'll see you very soon. We'll be doing event number two whatever's um, coming up next week. Until then, I'll see you soon. Goodbye.